welcome back to my channel honey Bree shines and for those who are joining me for the first time welcome so last night i didn't have an unboxing video or any kind of video because um i was actually really busy so i wanted to make sure that i got this video out to you guys tonight we're going to be doing another unboxing from diamond dot artistry so i'm going to feature an artist her name is gloria sanchez and these two diamond paintings are her artwork very very beautiful i can't wait to share them with you guys and i'm curious to see what you guys think so without further ado let's get to unboxing all right so the first diamond painting we have here it actually came like this <laughs> i think it got damaged probably in shipping because it does have the plastic wrap on it so i'm not sure but um i'm hoping everything is still in the box so we have our beautiful box here that shows you what packet what is included in the package and then you have your diamond painting instructions on the back here and then more package inclusions and your diamond painting kit so this is what diamond dot artistries look like and then we have our basic toolkit which comes with a tray a single placer diamond painting pen a squishy and two blue wax We've got our drills that I'll go ahead and put on the side for now. And then we have our beautiful diamond painting. So this one is called Life by Gloria Sanchez. And I'm going to go ahead and reverse roll this um, canvas because it is a poured glue canvas. Just so that we can get a straighter canvas. All right, guys. There she is. Look at this girl. She's so cute. So again, this one is called Life by Gloria Sanchez. We have Diamond Dot Artistry's logo right there at the top, as well as their website down here on the bottom. And then on both the left and right side, we have the schematic. So here is our beautiful girl. It's just a mini of the original photo. I did get this one in a 60 by 60. And this one is Round Drills. Oh, and I'll also go ahead and put an original photo on the video that way you can see what it looks like and um yeah sorry don't mind my son <laughs> he's just talking in the background this canvas has 30 colors i did reach out to diamond dot artistry because if you look on their website it says that they're supposed to be selected ab's in their diamond paintings but i don't think i got any so when i did email them they told me that they were going to look through my orders and send me the appropriate ab drills but i haven't gotten anything yet so I can't really tell you what's supposed to be ABs or not in this, but even if they don't send it, I'm going to probably add my own special drills to this anyway, especially for something like this. When you have something so vibrant and brilliant, you want to have like crystals and ABs going out throughout, especially like flowers and even the designs in her face. Like I'll probably actually use special drills in the face for this one because you know me, I don't like to use special drills in the face, but when it comes to like maybe even her lips and all these designs up here above her eyes. That's something that I want to bring out. So I'll probably use special drills for that. All right, so as for the canvas, Diamond Dot Artistry does use fabric canvases. So you can see it has this soft fabric backing and it does have these scalloped edges to prevent fraying. It kind of looks like it has a little bit of sparkle it's not as sparkly as some other canvases I've seen, but it does kind of have that little glitter sparkle in the background too. And then as for the symbols, we've got um, just alpha and numeric. So I really, really like that they use alpha and numeric because sometimes I do get confused with symbols looking alike or them using the exact same symbols for very similar colors, but maybe one is facing a different direction than the other. It can get confusing so i like that they use only alphanumeric and as you can see their quality is very well um i think it's a little bit difficult to see in the camera just because they do have that round guide around each um symbol or each numeric and alpha on here so that can kind of drown out the symbol a little bit but it's very legible just like if i look at it with my naked eye instead of through the camera you can definitely see the numerics and the the alphas on here pretty clearly even in like the dark areas too 
So I'll probably have to use a light pad for some of these because if you can't, if you can see that, this, this is actually a six. I don't even think you can see it through the camera, but that's um, going to be really hard for me to see um, without lighting in the background. So that is our canvas. Now let's get into the drills. All right. So here we have our drills. Um, they are in individual baggies, which of course is awesome because it's easier to kit down with these. Um, being that they are in individual baggies. I'm not sure if you can kind of see the color selection through here, but we've got some beautiful colors. We've got some pastels and some um, brilliant pinks. So I'm really, really happy about that. So it looks like we got a lot of this yellow. I'm thinking that this is going to be a lot of her face as well as some of the flowers up there. So I'm probably going to replace some of these with ABs for the flowers. Probably not her face because I want I rather do like special drills in these areas here. But this is the yellow that we have a lot of. And as you can see, I do see like a piece of trash in there, but it's not even a yellow trash. <laughs> but if you look at the drills, um, you can definitely see that it's nice and round and flat so i'm really really happy about this and i actually did reach out to this company to find out what kind of drills they use because it doesn't say on their site whether it's resin or acrylic and they told me that they actually use acrylic drills so diamond dot artistry does use acrylic drills and it's funny because I actually thought they were resin, but I'm still bad at it. I guess I can't really tell. I mean, you would think someone who works with resin can figure it out, but I honestly have no idea. They, As long as they, they sparkle, that's all that matters to me. But yeah, so these are acrylic drills. Take a look at some of these bright colors. Look at these colors. I think that's so beautiful. We've got this deep pink and this nice teal looking color. But yeah, so I'm looking at the consistency of size and they look very consistent. And like I said, a lot of flat bottoms. I see a few dips in some, but it's not like drastic dips. It's like right in the center, really small dips. So that shouldn't really affect in terms of having to move your drills around. But yeah, I really, really like these drills. I think they're good quality. And then we've got also three bags of this color. So, oh, you know what? Nope. This is one color, this is one color. So we've got two bags of this color, which I'm going to assume is the background because we have a lot of this color going, or we have a lot of greens going on in the background here. So yeah, there's gonna be quite a few color blocking in this diamond painting. It kind of reminds me of the one I'm working on now where like the background is pretty much color blocking, but there are some confetti. Like if you look here, you can definitely <laughs> see the confetti going on. But um, once you kind of pass that small area of confetti, then you get into more color blocking. So that'll be really nice. And again, this is a 60 by 60. So it's a nice snack size um, diamond painting to work on. But I don't know, I might, I might do this one for De Los Muertos this year. So we'll see, but I really, really like this. I think she's so cute. All right, guys, I'm going to roll her back up and put her back in the box, and then I'll open up the next one that we have by Gloria Sanchez. Be right back. All right, guys, so I am back with the next one. So this box was intact. Um, here is our beautiful girl, Persephone. This is a square diamond painting, also a 60 by 60, and um, also by Gloria Sanchez. So here we have our box. We've got... The package included here on the side, diamond painting instructions, and another package included. And look how pretty this box is. I think their design is so pretty. And it does have that sparkle, just like Diamond Art Club boxes. All right, guys. So here she is in all of her glory. So again, we have a poured glue canvas here. So let's go ahead and reverse roll her, just so that we can straighten her out a little bit more for presenting and viewing. Um, if you didn't know, poured glue canvases is definitely safe to reverse roll. It'll help get it straightened faster, but it's also fine because it is a poured glue canvas. But yeah, look at her, guys. She's so pretty. So again, this is Persephone by Gloria Sanchez. We have our Diamond Dot Artistry up at the top logo there. Artist, fun, therapeutic. Oh, I'm sorry. Artistic, fun, and therapeutic. And then down here, we have the Diamond Dot Artistry website. 
our two schematics on the both sides. So again, we have our beautiful original photo here, which of course I will go ahead and put the original photo on the video as well for you guys to see. And that way it's easier for you to see all of her beautiful colors and what her original rendering should look like which is very close to this. So I love diamond art artistry because I feel like a lot of their diamond paintings are very close to their photos itself. So I'm really, really happy with this and I'm, I can't wait to see what this looks like. And this diamond painting has 30 colors. Again, we won't have any ABs in here, although the site does say it does because of the situation with not getting any so hopefully they can rectify that and send me over some a b drills soon and as soon as i do if i when i do another unboxing of diamonds Out artistry i'll include those a b's that way you can see what they look like and for our squares here i again we only have alpha and numeric and i think it is very very legible again i'll probably have to use my light pad in the darker areas but it's very, very clearly printed. I love that the squares are outlined with white so that even though they are gonna be connected some diamond paintings, they don't do like an outline. So it's kind of hard to see where <laughs> each drill should go, but they do do outlines. So in like the lighter areas, they have like a brownish tan gray, I guess, color. And then the rest is like a whitish color, unless it's all gray and just looks white in the darker areas. but. Yeah, so if you can see, they have the guides, and I love those guides. All right, let's get into the drills. So we have our square drill drills here, and as you can see, we've got a lot of beautiful colors in here. We've got some pastels. We've got some brilliant colors. We've got a lot of this peach color here. Yeah, four bags of it, so that's quite a lot of peach. I'm thinking this is going to be a lot of the flowers as well as her skin color, which I'm happy with. This is definitely a nice skin color. So if you can see, I do see some trash in here. It's like bits and pieces, so that's fine. It doesn't look like it's the actual drills that has trash. It's more the, um, I guess, the extra acrylic that falls off of it when they make them. But other than that, they look pretty consistent in size. I don't really see any issues with them, like being in different sizes or no flat bottoms because I must say their bottoms look awesome <laughs> and then we've got like this teal color which is gonna go in like her dress and in the background here I'm gonna pick a pretty pink oh here we got some red going on oh you know what this is for the flowers up there that's gonna look look how bright this color is isn't this such a pretty red and again, like this one is a little easier to see the consistency because it doesn't have as many drills in it. But if you can tell, it has that beautiful sparkle and it's nice consistent sizes. So I'm really, really happy with their drill quality. It may not be resin, which I did read somewhere that resin drills are supposedly sparklier than acrylic drills. But again, I can't really tell the difference. Maybe if I compare it like one next to another, then I'll be able to see the difference. But um, again, if as long as it looks pretty and it looks sparkly, that's kind of all that matters to me. <laughs> I just want it to look pretty. But look at this color. More of her dress in the background down here. But yeah. All right, guys, so here you have our two beautiful diamond paintings, Life and Persephone by Gloria Sanchez. She is a licensed artist for Diamond Dot Artistry, and you can find these diamond paintings online. They are in stock and ready to go, so you can definitely purchase any of these if you want to. She does have a lot of other beautiful artwork that I wanted to get. Um, I believe she had another skull face that I wanted, um, super cute little girl diamond painting. So I might go back and look at what she has, um, still available, but yeah, she does have a lot on there. And, um, next time I will feature a different artist from Diamond Dot Artistry. I did try to select a few artists that I like their diamond work or their diamond paintings from, and I'll try to do like specific unboxings per artist. That way you can see what 
that specific artist has and if you like it you can look online for that artist because they do have an artist search when you're looking up diamond paintings but yeah so again gloria sanchez diamond dot artistry check them out guys i'll link their website in my um description box below and yeah so if you guys haven't already please subscribe to my channel i really appreciate it thank you guys for all your kind words and prayers towards my daughter she's getting better slowly every day but she's on the mend and definitely headed in the right direction so i'm happy about that Hopefully I'll be able to get a video out to you guys tomorrow. If I'm at the hospital though, I probably won't. So I'll try to, but if not, I will see you guys the day after. Like this video, go ahead and comment. Please keep your comments kind and I will be more than happy to reply to them. And I hope you guys have a good evening. All right, bye.